Okay. We're rolling. Okay. Well, these are the good shots. <laughs> Sheila and we are the sparrows and we're here to talk about weddings life love having fun dogs just life adventure just a little bit of everything she's just drinking straight Disarono right now so that's that's where we're going with this to start <laughs> so we have a company called love sparrows and we do flowers bartending day of coordinating and a little bit of rentals here and there but uh, this video, the purpose of it is for you to get to know us. Uh, we want to show you who we are, the people behind Love Sparrows. So I'll, uh, I'll start out with me. I'm Allison. I'm the short one. Um, <laughs> and I'm the one who does not look like Ruby Rose as well. <laughs> I am the floral designer and I pretty much have started to build Love Sparrows and make it my baby. And along the way, Sheila wanted to find a way to be a part of it in her own special way. So while I handle florals, Sheila handles bartending and we both do a day of coordinating. Um, on a personal level, I am a bathaholic. I love taking baths. I could take three a day if I was allowed to. And I love dogs, I love doing my hair, and I love my hair itself. <laughs> a lot. And um, I love street tacos. I could eat them along with baths and street tacos three times a day. With a lush bath bomb. <laughs> In the bath. So yeah. I'll let Sheila tell you about who she is. Uh, so I'm the tall one. Um, I definitely am, am the people pleaser and I tend to talk more. Uh, sometimes, sometimes it's a little too much, but <laughs> I think it's fun. My jokes don't always land, but I try really hard. Um, I love video games and bears, tattoos, the gym. Uh, I guess I, I bartend. That's really fun. I like finding new drinks and making people happy and my talkativeness comes out when I'm behind the bar and I like to interact with each guest and I love learning what they're drinking for the night and learn their patterns and impress them when they come back so that's always a blast for me because people don't see that coming all the time I try really hard um I don't know am I that deep is there anything else about me that's <laughs> <I'm> that deep <laughs> but yeah we, we came up with some questions to ask each other uh we don't know what those questions are so I have no idea what she's going to ask me right now. I'm a little <laughs> nervous. But um, this just kind of gives you a vibe for us and and how we react to things too. Yeah. So, uh, what, you want to start? Sheila, who is Marcus? <laughs> oh, God. Um, oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Um, oh, God, we just talked about this. Yeah. Marcus... Uh, is a zit. Marcus was a zit on someone's face in a show that I desperately am trying to remember. Oh God, this is Marcus. Sheila, oh, will you accept oh, this? Oh yeah. Show? Oh God, it's the Bachelorette. Yes. Uh, yeah, it's uh, this current one. Hannah. Hannah. She watches them all without me since I still have a day job. <laughs> um, but I catch little bits, and there's a reference to Marcus that I understood. I was gonna go with with Real Housewives, but great job. No, Nailed it. I thought it was Pamela Anderson. You gave me the hint. Pamela No, 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 no. Bachelorette. No, it's the Bachelorette. I'm... The internet's going to hate us. <laughs> We're going to cut this part out. We're going to cut this part out. Cut it. Okay. Your turn again. Um, If you had to choose between eating six ounces of raw fish or me losing a pinky finger. I would eat six ounces of raw fish. <laughs> what kind of human do you think I am? Give you, me some credit here. You really hate. You really 
I hate, hate fish. fish. I'm terrified of fish. But you tell me you're going to chop off my wife's pinky. I'm going to eat I mean, but I'd, I'd survive without a pinky. Like, I didn't say my hand. I said my pinky. That is so rude. I would never. I wouldn't. Would you hesitate? No. <laughs> Allison. Yes, Sheila. How often would you say you fart in the bed? <laughs> I would say probably actually only like once a month. Really? Yeah. It doesn't happen to me that often. I don't like to fart in the bath. It's a relaxing space that should smell good. I would just think that you kind of relax. Like, it would just happen a little more often than that. Not necessarily just, like, once a month, give or take. I'm surprised. I'm impressed. Thanks. <laughs> you, you have a lot of faith in me today. <laughs> so much faith in me. Oh, yeah. Um, all right, Sheila. If you had to guess how long my feet were in inches, what would you say the length is? Three inches. You have the smallest three. feet in the planet. <laughs> Do you know how big three inches is? Um, okay, so I think This I, is three inches. I brought this for you. This oh is my three God. inches. Okay, this so. This is how long Sheila thinks my feet are. I'm gonna guess your feet are, are like. Um, I gotta guess inches. Don't show me. Um, uh, this looks. I'm gonna guess seven inches. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, I nailed so that's it. That's seven inches. I nailed. Okay, so I was right on the measurement. Of seven inches, but am I actually accurate on your foot size? Uh, I mean, if we're not counting toes, I'm on it. <laughs> it's you're like an eight and a half. I have an eight and a half inch foot. Boom. <laughs> so, this is us. We are uh, a pair of wives, and we have three dogs. We live up in the mountains. We are building our legacy, which is Love Sparrows. We work our butts off. Uh, we're really silly. I like to say that we're our own relationship goals because truly I haven't had such a healthy relationship in my whole entire life. And we really do enjoy laughing with each other. We hope that we can bring you on with laughs and um, just enjoy the banter that we have back and forth sometimes mm -hmm. and just share the love. In a serious note, we want to share our love with you. We want to educate you about all things weddings and we want to be something that makes you smile during your day. So in our next video, we are going to touch on coordinating and we're going to talk a little bit about the stories that we've experienced as wedding coordinators, not necessarily as uh, guests of a wedding. We see more of the details that we don't tell the brides and grooms that have happened that we've saved them yeah. from. Um, we'll also take questions on our Instagram and Facebook and we'll be answering those on there and just to touch base that we're here to have fun and we're here to take you on our life adventure with us. Yeah, so follow us, subscribe to our channel, welcome, this is just the beginning and we can't wait to bring you on our adventures. Our adventures. <laughs> our adventures. <laughs> adventures.